cruising weather. I know we said we were going to set off early but it is now it is 10.35 which to be to be honest 10.35 is pretty early for us and uh, we've just gone through the first two lots on our way out of Birmingham and we're going through the third now after it's rained. <laughs> there better be. The rain's eased off now thankfully. It was getting quite heavy for a bit there. We've still got another seven locks to go I think. It's another 24 locks today that we've got to do so another seven and then we're at the bottom of the flight. Once we reach the end of the lock flight, there are some services, so we're going to fill up with water, empty the toilet cassettes, and if we can find some moorings, hopefully stop for the day, because to be perfectly honest, I'm a bit cold, a bit wet, and I want to sit in front of the fire with a cup of tea and warm up again. I'm literally stuck on the bottom of the lock. I can't move the boat. So Ryan has just gone up to check the next lock to see if perhaps it's been left open, which is what's causing the pound to be drained. And I'm just chilling in the lock until we can get it sorted. i 
managed to get ourselves out of that lock by carefully draining some of the water from the previous pan, which was quite a big one, so we were lucky, we watched the water levels so that the same thing didn't happen to the previous pound. And Ryan went back to the last couple of locks and emptied some water out of them down the flight so that there was a lot more water flowing through because they were all fine, they were all overflowing so they had plenty of water to share. So we're just inching through this pound uh, coming up to the next lock and Ryan says that after this lock it's all fine again it's just this one lock appears to have a leaky door and we think that might be what the issue is but we're unstuck I literally have my fingers crossed to make sure I get through this and don't get stuck see the water level in this pound is perfectly fine so it literally was just that one pound for some reason coming up to the last lock now thank goodness <laughs> it's been a lot longer than we thought and I am definitely ready for that cup of tea it's getting quite dark now got some dark clouds coming over so we might be getting might be in for some more rain oh, it started raining again pull it up obviously people coming in that way come in a wee bit too fast judging by the crash preventative measures that they've taken along here and I believe there was a sign wasn't there Maggie can you take a step out of the way please there's a big red sign telling them to slow so obviously there's been a few minor bingles please respect our boundary wall <laughs> the lights really pretty on the lights here just just kind of ignore all those electric power lines and stuff you know we'll just we'll just cut that out can we edit that <laughs> I'm not that skilled well we'll just say um, oh no the Sun is in my eyes so I'm blocking it but look how pretty it is 